Today I'm going to show you a fabulous, decadent, rich dessert that takes less than 10 minutes total to make. Let's make this beautiful banoffee mess on the One Pot Chef. First things first, I've got some whipped cream here. This is 300 mils of cream, which I have just whipped up until it's nice and thick and got soft peaks. Secondly, I've got these little meringue nests. These are like little mini pavlovas or little meringue pieces. I've got eight of them and I'm just going to crush them up roughly into the cream. Now you want big pieces and small pieces and crumbly bits, just a bit of a mixture. Don't be too brutal with it. You want some lumps. And just using a spatula, we're just going to gently fold the cream and the meringue mixture together, just so everything's nicely coated and mixed together. Perfect. Now just set that aside. Next, I've got half a cup of toffee sauce. This is just store-bought caramel sauce, the same stuff you would put over ice cream or put on desserts. And what we're going to do is we're just going to gently warm this in the microwave for about 10-15 seconds. If you don't have a microwave, you can do this on the stovetop. But the key is to make sure that it is warm, not hot. Because we don't want it to be too hot, otherwise it will start melting the cream and everything and it will become a giant mess. Which, admittedly, that's in the title, but we don't want it to be too messy. Once the sauce is warmed, I'm going to add in two bananas, which I've sliced up. And just using a spoon, just gently toss the bananas until they're all coated in that beautiful sauce. I've got four serving glasses here. I'm using some old fashioned milkshake glasses, but any serving glasses will be fine. And what we're going to do is divide half of the banana mixture between the four glasses, followed by half of the cream meringue mixture. Then simply repeat with the remaining bananas and meringue mixture. Last but not least, a little sprinkle of grated dark chocolate over the top. And these are ready to go. And here we have our super quick banoffee mess. It's gorgeous, it's rich, it's sticky and gooey. And it takes less than 10 minutes to make. It's perfect for last minute dinner parties or just when you want something decadent to snack on. Oh my, that is naughty. Better get my spoon out. Okay. Let's see if I can get a bit of everything. Mm. Oh my. <laughs> Didn't quite get a bit of everything. I better have another taste. <laughs> mm. That's stunning. <laughs> mm. It's hard to believe that that was so quick to make because literally that's like some expensive dessert you'd order at a restaurant but that was literally 10 minutes it's a bit of crushing of the meringues a bit of whipping of cream and then just putting it into glasses anyone can do this trust me it will be a hit well i hope you enjoyed this recipe check out my other videos at onepotchefshow.com and until next time see you later you can use this basic recipe to make all sorts of different kinds of desserts don't like caramel Replace it with chocolate sauce or any other sauce you like. Don't like bananas? You can change the fruit up as well. You could leave the sauce out altogether and do a mixture of fruit. Uh, something like mango, pineapple, maybe a bit of strawberry in there as well would be fantastic. It's really just a matter of going with your favourite tastes and just sticking them all together.